Sexism is any bias or discrimination against people based on their sex or gender. Sexism at work includes derogatory comments, objectification, sexist humor, over-familiar remarks, ignoring or disrespecting people, inappropriate comments about dress, physical appearance, and sexist body language. Let's take a look at a few examples of sexism at work. Lata, a senior woman employee, is denied an international posting on the assumption that she will not be able to take up an international assignment as her daughter is in 12th grade. Denying promotion, raise or a plum opportunity to a deserving female candidate, assuming she will not be able to strike a work-life balance is sexism. Abhinav, a sales manager who was upset about losing a major deal, is made fun of by his colleagues that he is emotional like women. Stereotyping emotions to a gender in a derogatory manner is sexism. Samir, while addressing a group of male and female employees, always refers to them as guys. He also calls his female subordinates as sweetie, sweetheart, love or babe. Addressing colleagues and subordinates with words and pronouns related to a gender in objectified or derogatory manner is sexism. Ashok takes the opinion of his male teammates during a group meeting and does not involve the other teammates. Inviting opinion only from male colleagues in a group meeting or ignoring other members is sexism. Rita is often asked in interviews on her plans to start a family as she has been married for a few years. She can see the obvious discomfort of the interviewers in case she says she plans to start a family soon. Asking a woman in an interview when she plans to start a family just because she is married is sexism. Also, labeling a woman as bossy or overambitious if she shows aggression at work or trying to simplify and explain a topic to a woman employee, thinking she is unintelligent or not aware, is also a form of sexism. In today's workplace, instances of sexism are not limited to any specific sex or gender. People from the LGBTQ plus community being stereotyped and subjected to microaggressions or ridiculed at work for their gender identity is also a form of sexism. While sexism can manifest in various forms, the way to combat sexism at work is for people to be more aware of how they are being treated and to voice their opinion in case they feel discriminated against based on their sex or gender.